So I'm Hayley, I live in York with my husband Maff and my baby boy Luke Thor. And York's where I run my two businesses, which are Glory Days, my bridal boutique, and my design label Rolling in Roses. Well, I started off a quite an unconventional route because I studied costume design rather than fashion. So I was just freelance working in TV and the film and theatre and stuff. And I was making the wedding dress for my sister and we were looking for ideas and we ended up having to go to London to look for ideas and find vintage wedding dresses and things to look at. So there was nowhere up here that we could go and so it was on that trip that I had total epiphany and um, thought I would open a cool bridal shop up here. It's, it's lovely working here in York and making in Britain. There's no way I would ever want to outsource it. First of all because I, I'm originally a dressmaker and I love making. I would never want it any other way. Second of all, I wouldn't like to lose control of the quality of my dresses. I want to you know, be able to see what my seamstresses are making and make sure that they're of the quality that I originally intended them to be. But also making in Britain, obviously, is more eco-friendly because you're not shipping them over from the other side of the world and you, know, you can make sure that they're ethically produced and you know, you're in control of that. So yeah, this, with the new collection especially, we're really concentrated on finding as many ethical and eco-friendly fabrics as we can. I mean, it's been such a mission and such a quest to find because they've actually been quite difficult to source. Um, but I think everybody nowadays is more and more aware of the fashion industry and what you know the effects of it are. And I just don't want to be a part of that, you know. And I think a lot of people, you're spending your hard-earned money on a, a really important and magical dress. You want to know that it's not co contributing to that in the world. If I was to describe Rolling in Roses, I would say probably quite romantic and quite a hopeless romantic and quite um, unrestrained, kind of cool and comfortable. A lot of people comment on how comfortable our dresses are compared to you know, a lot of mainstream dresses. I think the, overall the kind of bride that we attract, whether that's the way we run the boutique or just actually design styles, are generally people who are more relaxed, more open-minded, who have slightly less formal weddings maybe. Um, so we have a lot of brides where comfort is really something that they really want to bear in mind. Maybe they're having a festival wedding, they want to be able to dance all night in the dress. Maybe they've got little kids that they want to be able to pick up and, and you know, spin around in the air. We've had brides on motorbikes, you know, all sorts. So there's all these brides that don't want to be forced into the same ball gown dresses that are boned and uncomfortable and restrictive. So I think we definitely cater for, you know, within reason, a certain type of bride. Having said that, you know, we have brides of all different wedding styles and all different ages, but who doesn't want to be comfortable, right?